Hey guys, gals, and non-binary pals, it's Jess, and welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to do this video because I've been really loving doing lookbooks. I did a lookbook about two or three weeks ago, and you guys seem to really like it. So I'm back here again, and yes, as you can tell by the title, I am going to be doing a Valentine's Day themed lookbook, but they won't be typical Valentine's Day themed like outfits. Like, I just don't put red and pink together and call it a day. Like, this is some flair with it. It's it's nice, okay? And I tried for most of the pieces to be from Yes Style. So like 99.9% .9 of the pieces are from Yes Style besides like two or three things. But yeah, so if you guys are ever interested in purchasing any of the items that, I'll, that I will be showing, I also have a discount code right here with Yes Style. And I also have a rewards link, which will be down below in the description. And all of the links to all the outfits, all of the clothing items will be down below in the description as well. And if you guys are ever interested, in receiving items like me to make your own lookbooks on social media, whether it be on TikTok or YouTube or Pinterest, then definitely consider signing up to be a Yes Style influencer, which you can also do through my link in the description. So before we get into the outfits, I do want to show you guys my makeup. This is what it looks like. It's just a very simple, um, I don't really know what I was going for. I was just going for something simple, but really, really cute. and. A valentine's day look i guess but i'm really really obsessed she looks so good and if you guys are aren't new to my channel you'll know whenever i do videos of me doing my makeup the blush never really shows up on camera because my ring light always washes me out but if you can tell right now you can really see my blush okay and i didn't even put that much so i am going to introduce you guys to this blush that i am wearing right now i am so thankful that merit beauty actually sent me two blushes so i have them in this bag right here super cute it's like a like a lunch bag too it reminds me of they sent me two blushes right here i will show you and yeah they actually released four new colors and i got two of their new colors and i'll show you guys right now so the one i'm wearing right now is actually a prey a pre it's french okay i hope i'm saying it right if i'm not i'm sorry i don't have that french accent but here it is right here and then this is the color um can you guys see right from here it looks dark right but on the cheeks it actually blends out to be this really nice wine pinkish red I don't know it's super super pretty it is also super pigmented so a little goes a long way and it still gives off a very natural glowy look like it's such a good blush like i'm actually very very impressed i don't know i think i feel like this is one of my new favorite blushes they're actually also made in south korea i was reading the boxes and i feel like that's another reason why it's so good but i'm gonna swatch it for you guys right now so you can see how good it looks Okay, I didn't press that hard, but if I wanted to, it would be darker, okay? But I just wanted you to see how it looks like, because anyways, you're not gonna wear a super, super dark blush, unless you want to, then be my guest. But as I'm saying, is that it blends out to be this really nice shade right here, and I just barely pressed it. Um, but yeah, you just put it on your cheek and blend, and it looks super good. Next color I got was Fox, and this color was also really, really pretty. I didn't wear it for this look. It's more of a peachish, orangish, tone but it's super 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 natural it's really really pretty um yeah i don't know i'm really obsessed so this is what the color looks like and i'll swatch it again for you guys so wait hold on maybe i'll use a different finger so it's even but see okay sorry it looks super faint oh there you go i feel like i'm not doing it justice it looks super light because i'm not i'm barely like pressing on it but it can be pigmented if you want to Okay, and then, but that was, that's like how it blends basically. Super, super pretty and super natural, as I said, super glowy. I feel like these are the best blushes to use if you're going for like a makeup, no makeup, makeup look. Although I'm not doing that look right now. I'm like, it's definitely a good blush to have. So I will have a link down below to all the blushes, the two blushes I showed you guys and all that good stuff. And actually Merit Beauty offers free shipping for orders $40 and up. And they also offer a their signature merit bag with like your first purchase. I'm gonna assume this might be the bag. I'm not sure entirely, but I mean, this is the bag they sent me, so I'm just gonna assume. But look how cute it is. It really reminds me of like a cute little lunch bag, but yeah. Okay, that's enough talking, let's get into the outfits. Okay, for the first outfit, I'm actually already wearing the top, but 
Okay, so you guys are gonna see in the outfit thing anyways, but um, this is the top. It's basically this long sleeve. There's a square uh, neck cutout, and yeah, it's just a simple black long sleeve. I love flattering necklines, so this is really up my alley. And then I paired it with this gray skirt. As I said, I'm not really going for the traditional Valentine's Day look because boring, we're over that, okay? This is more of my take on Valentine's Day, not to be bitter. I'm not being better right now, but I'm just saying, this is my take. I like to call, I'm actually calling this specific look the anti-romantic look, um, QTXT. Anyways, um, yeah, but I love that song. So then I pair it with this gray skirt right here. As I said, these are all for me a style. Um, this cute little gray mini skirt, pleated mini skirt. It's so cute because I love it because it's short in the front, like a cute mini skirt, but it's also long in the back. So it actually protects your behind and I love that. And then I finally paired it with this gray shrug, dark gray shrug to pull everything together. I think it's super cute. This is super nice quality, by the way. It's like thick and warm. So I definitely recommend getting this. I love it. And then I just paired uh, white leg warmers. You can use whatever leg warmers you have. Uh, this is the one I just pulled out of my closet. And then I actually decided to use shoes that I never ever wear. Uh, in this video and so I actually paired it with these loafers that I also got from YesStyle but I have never like really styled them before so I was excited to style them now but yeah okay for the second outfit I don't really know what to call it I'm gonna call it like maybe rock star girlfriend or you hate valentine's day or like I don't know yeah maybe I'll call this look galentines I don't really have like names for my outfits yet but Maybe I'll come up with them after I film this. But anyways, the first top is this pink um, tank top right here. It's also a similar neckline as this, if you guys can tell. It's like a square neckline, which I really love. And yes, it's, this is a pink, so I am going for that traditional V-Day look, kind of, but I add some spice into it. So I'm wearing this black mini skirt right here. It's kind of hard to see, but it comes with a belt like this kind of belt. I don't know what's called a grommet belt, like with the silver holes. And yeah, I really, really love this skirt. I wear it all the time. And then I paired the top with my black uh, bolero, shrug, whatever you want to call it. Just simple black bolero, whatever. You could pair it with like anything, a long sleeve, a cardigan, whatever works for you. And then I paired the whole look, or to finish it off, I wore my Demonias, my four and a half inch, shaker 90s i don't remember but yeah so that's why i call it like more of a grunge not really but rock star girlfriend type of vibe if i was a rock star girlfriend i don't know but i think it's still really really cute and lastly i don't know what to call this one <sighs> see like i don't know i seriously don't know maybe this one's like giving bookworm to me i don't know like you go on a date a v-day date to barnes and noble like that's I love Barnes & Noble guys, like it's such a happy place for me. So I could see myself wearing this there. But once again, I'm wearing the same top that I just showed you in pink, but this time it's in black. So same concept, everything, just a different color. And then I paired it with this dark denim maxi skirt. And I'm gonna try and find a link for you guys, like a similar one. But this one in particular is actually from my mom's closet, so. I don't have any links for it, unfortunately. And yeah, this is like, it's a, I wanna say vintage, but is it? I don't know, she's had it. I'm pretty sure she's had this skirt longer than she's had me as a daughter. So that says a lot. But yeah, this, this long denim mini skirt you, or maxi skirt, you can find them. Just look it up, I don't know. But as I said, I'll probably um, try to find one and link one for you guys. And then lastly, to spice it up because that's a cute fit by itself, but it's not giving V-Day. But also I love the necklace that I paired with all the outfits because it gives V-Day by itself, the red, and also the bows. I love bows. Also, I'm wearing these cute little bow earrings. Sorry to get sidetracked. I'm the type of person that does that, but yeah, this is for my style too, in case you were interested in accessories for your V-Day looks. Um, I'm wearing bow earrings and a bow necklace. I love bows, if you weren't aware. Anyways, I paired it off with this pink scarf, but I didn't actually wear it around my neck because I don't know, I didn't want to. If it is cold where you live, I mean, it's cold where I live, but I just, I didn't want to wear a scarf. I don't know, it just didn't fit the outfit that way. Um, yeah, 
but I wore it like um like this kind of thing. I don't know what it's called, but I see it a lot in the movies, especially when people are going on red carpets or going to watch like going to the theater. But I don't mean like movie theater. I mean like opera theater, or like ballet. Like they go to see something like prestigious or whatever. They always have like this little. Is this a shrug? But they like have a little off the shoulder shrug moment. So I just did that with my pink scarf, and so this touch of pink really adds onto the v-day look okay so that's it for today's video i really hope you guys enjoyed watching it as much as i enjoyed filming it if you did then leave a like and even if you didn't still leave a like because you really have nothing to lose and everything to gain which is my happiness and yeah thank you again merit beauty for sending me those blushes they're so so cute and don't forget to check out the description for all the links codes all that good stuff um make sure to leave a comment down below what was your favorite outfit outfit one two or three outfit anti-romantic um galentine's or bookworm i don't know i just came up with that off the spot on the spot but yeah, and don't forget to subscribe to join this growing family. I do have a little analytics chart right here so you guys can see that there are so many of you that are watching my videos but aren't subscribed. So consider subscribing. It's free, it takes one click of a button and it helps me out a lot. Um, yeah, I don't know. I post weekly and I come up with all these little cute fun videos. I don't know, I'm really loving lookbooks. But yeah, subscribe and let me know that you wanna see more of this content and make sure to have my notification bell on because I am a college student and I have midterms coming up again. So click the notification bell because there could be a time where I end up not posting or I post on like a different day or time. Cause as I said, conflicting schedules. So turn it on so you know exactly when I post. That's pretty much it. So I'll see all of you in the next video. I love all of you guys and I hope you all have a blessed day. Bye.